Dyson Hoover, Dyson Hoover, what? Hello everyone and welcome back to another episode of Ryan's Corner. It's been a while guys, it's been a while. Not for you guys because I've backlogged a few videos, but basically I'm just back from Brussels. Um, hopefully these videos line up because they're a bit of a mess at the moment. But basically I'm just back, this desk is filthy man. What the fuck, over here is a mess. I need to get my duster back out guys. It's been, it's been a while and uh, Jesus Christ. But yeah guys, I'm just back from Brussels and if you don't know, there's actually a big Lego shop over in Brussels, which I was super buzzing for. So I went there guys, and I'm just gonna show you what I picked up. I don't really have any footage or anything of me in the Lego shop because I'm not, I'm not that kind of a person. I'm not that kind of vain where I'm like, oh guys, what's up? Here's my fucking phone. I'm gonna vlog and we, no, I'm not. This isn't that type of channel. So if you switched on this to see like my experience in there, there's just, you're not gonna get it. So basically guys, I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna show you. Is this gonna be like a, a mini haul, I guess, about my experience in the Lego shop in Brussels and stuff. Um, yeah. So here we go, here's my Lego bag. Um, it's seen better days, as you can tell. You had to bring this back on the plane, guys, and it got fucked up. It got absolutely fucked up. So what did I get, guys? I got some, uh, some waffles, guys. Got some Belgian waffles. Um, I didn't get these in the Lego shop, I have to say. I got these somewhere else, but they're in there anyway. But yeah, guys, Belgian waffles. Fucking elite. Get yourself over to Belgium, guys, and get some waffles, man. They are something else. But yeah, guys, here's the Lego bag. I absolutely love Lego's bags. I have to say, I think they look super cool, super cute, uh, fitting in so nicely with the kind of theme of Lego itself. To me, guys, Lego is yellow. What do you guys think? If I was to think, if the first colour that comes to mind when I think of Lego, it's yellow. Leave it in the comments what you guys think. But for me, yeah, guys, I just imagine Lego yellow bricks. What? Yeah, but here it is, guys. Yeah, the bag got kind of fucked up. I'm just going to show you what I got. So first off, guys, we have another little bag here inside. Look at that. Isn't that so cute? Look at that. That's so nice. Oh, but it up here, guys, and I got, bang, got a little Lego keychain when I was over there. I already have one. Um, fuck, where is it? So, yeah, guys, here's my main keys where I have my uh, Star Destroyer uh, keychain, which I got in my, well, Lego, my May Lego haul from May the 4th. Um, so I got this with it. So that's that's a really nice keychain I have here. And I also have this uh, other one of Elmo, which my friend picked up for me. Ironically, in the Brussels store as well. He was there and he picked this up for me and then I went. But um, yeah, so there's this one here. And now I'm going to add my own little Lego brick to my collection. For those of you who don't know, I used to have a big problem with keychains. I used to have a big fucking bunch of them this size. And I took them all off after years. I finally took them all off. And now I'm slowly building them back up again. So uh, yeah, and they're all kind of Lego themed now. So I'm going to put him on there. So this is nice. How much is this? I think it was like $3.99 or something. Pretty standard for a keychain. But he's going to look really nice on them. And also in this bag, guys, we got... Bang! We got a little uh, Lego mug. Yeah, guys. Um, I wanted a mug for the channel because I'm using this guy currently. I have a few other mugs. But I thought a nice Lego mug might be cool. And uh, I picked this one up in the Lego shop. And he is super cute. Look at him. He's super nice. So he'll be nice sitting there like that in future videos. I should have got a Lego coaster. I wonder if they do them. Might look into that. Yeah, I think this is like a tenner. But um, that's okay for a mug, I suppose, especially like a licensed mug for Lego. That's really nice. Yeah, guys, he's going to look really cute in future videos. I uh, need to give him a wash, though. Fuck, he's probably in bits. He's probably filthy. So anyway, guys, uh, that's it for my mini bag. Moving on to the rest of the bag, guys. What else we got in here? We've got... Bang, we've got more Lego tulips, guys. For those who don't know, I have actually a review of these already on the channel, but I wanted to pick up more and... Um, yeah, and to build up my bouquet and make it look a bit bigger, a little bit fuller. If you guys haven't seen these before, if you want to go check out my review of them, uh, it should be in the description below. So leave him over there. What else we pick up, guys? We also got, bang, we got the Lego roses, guys. Here's the Lego roses, guys. And um, yeah, I've been buzzing to pick these up. I was going to pick them up on Amazon and they were like 20 euro because Lego actually retired these. You can't buy them anymore. So I was so surprised to walk into the Lego shop and see them there. And at the moment on Amazon, they're like 20 quid. And yet the Lego shop was sending them for like a tenner. So I was like, dead, I picked them up here. Now that I'm thinking about it, I should have picked up a couple of them. But, um, ah, sure. So I'm going to build more of these and I'm going to build some of the roses and I'm going to put them together and it's going to make my bouquet look a bit fuller. Let me know if you want to see a review of these, guys. I might do them as a kind of a small Wednesday style video. Let me know if you want me to do a review of these. Also, guys, uh, I put up a thing on Instagram uh, for a vote of should I pick up my minions, the big minions set. And... It was an overwhelming 100% yes, I should pick this up. And I feel terrible because I didn't actually pick it up. I was going to, I was, I was going to pick it up. But the box is just too big and I was like, I'm not going to get this through the airport. I've, I'm not going to fit this in any bag or anything. I'm disappointed too because I didn't want to pick it up. But um, I will pick it up. I 100% will pick it up, guys. 
uh, at some stage in, in my future LEGO hauls or whatever, I will pick it up and we, we will do a review on it. We've done two millions reviews on this channel, so I do want to do that set and it will come out eventually which which is really weird because the box is this fucking big but yeah when you build it the set's actually pretty small i'm like why, why do you need that big of a box minions and the last set that i picked up guys is bang it's this set guys this is the santa sleigh set or otherwise known as the reindeer battle pack because it's the only way you can get these many fucking reindeers in a set yeah guys at the moment this set is out of stock on the lego website this is a super hot seller at the moment for lego and I was like, I was trying to buy it recently there and it's just not coming back in the stock. And I was like, oh, fuck it, never mind. It's, it's probably going to be out of stock till Christmas. And I was like, oh, never mind. And then I went to the Lego shop and it was just there. And I was like, holy shit, I'm buying this. There's a lot of other cute Christmas sets out at the moment, guys. And I will pick some up, guys. We will have some Christmas reviews in time for Christmas. They also did like a Christmas wreath set or something. And it actually looks super nice, but it's like 30 euro. I don't really know if it's worth it. Um, let me know if you want me to pick that one up. But I will do some more Christmas videos on the channel, guys, including this one. Anything else in here, guys? Nope. I can finally throw out this bag, guys, because holy shit, look at the state of this. Big hole in it now, look. Big fucking hole in it. So there's everything I picked up, guys, in the Lego shop in Brussels. Overall, my experience at Lego shop was whopper. It's the first time I've been into a Lego shop since I've kind of gotten into Lego and started this whole channel. So it was really cool to just be around here and kind of look at the different sets and really appreciate it. The last time I was in one was in the one in London, which I didn't really fully appreciate because I wasn't into Lego or anything at the time. But it was so cool to get this. Overall, the shop was deadly. The people are great there. Um, I'd highly recommend going to any Lego shops. Um, I'm so buzzing to build this set. I'm going to keep it up for a while though, guys, uh, up until Christmas. Hope you guys enjoyed the videos while I was gone. Let me know what else you guys want to see because I have a lot of fucking sets to get through. I'm working on another Lego haul. That should be out soon. Anyway, guys, uh, you are deadly. Keep doing what you're doing. Like and subscribe and all that shit. You are a whopper. And until next time, guys, I'll see you soon and stay safe out there.